Got this feeling. I'm feeling you could be the one. I see no reason why I should ever let you go. Mm. Don't wanna wake up if I'm dreaming because you know I can't get enough of this feeling you're giving me. Don't wanna wake up. everyone welcome back to my channel welcome back to the new weekly vlog i haven't posted in two weeks now and i'm sorry for that but since i've gone back to work it's been kind of a little bit stressful and then i had all of the things to do and i decided to just maybe pause a little bit on the vlogging but now i'm back even though i'm kind of trying to squeeze vlogging in between as much as i can um because for well it's been Think around a month i think since we're also taking care of our neighbor's dog maggie of course you know her probably and um well that's because they are working really really late literally they go to the work like in the morning and come back close to the evening um so usually whenever i come home i what i do is first i do my workout then uh prepare the food or if it's already prepared, then I just kind of uh, heat it and that's it. And then I take Kali and Maggie out and <laughs> Kali usually poops very quickly. Maggie, on the other hand, needs a lot more time. So yeah, that's why I've kind of decided, you know what, I'm going to give give myself two weeks off so I can kind of get uh, a, a, like a new habit of doing things. And then I, you know, said, okay, it's time to vlog now. So now I'm vlogging, now I'm back, and I'm kind of glad I am, because I missed vlogging, honestly. Um, but as I said, it's been really, like, hectic, and then when I just laid down, I was like, oh, I'm so kind of not in the mood for the vlog. I mean, for vlogging, and then I just went on to watching my shows. And now I am obsessed with Manifest on Netflix. I've watched, well... Quite a few shows, I think. Well, me and Anna do watch Young Sheldon as well. Uh, but that's more of like a comedy, you know, sitcom. But yeah, but uh, Manifest is actually very, very good. I started watching it. I don't know. It might be when I started working. So yeah, it's been three weeks since I'm watching it, I think. I'm on the second season now and I'm, I'm loving it. It's just, you know, it's drama. Everyone gets like turned in into drama. So yeah, I'm loving that. And uh, that's all I'm watching now, basically, and just doing my things as much as I can. Although I do feel very, very tired uh, compared to the time that I was at home. I mean, obviously, I, I'm working my, I'm working two shifts. So in one week, I'm first shift, second week, I'm second, and so on. And that's kind of something that my body isn't very much used to. So whenever I, you know, if I'm in the, if, if I'm working my second shift, then it's kind of okay because I get enough sleep. But when I switch to the first shift, um, I love working for shifts because I have so much of my afternoon to myself. Um, and I'm not really big fan of second shifts, but I am very much more like relaxed or just I, I get enough sleep when I'm in my second shift so it would be good if I had you know only one shift um you know as for working like only in the morning because then my body would get used to waking up at this and this time but with my two shifts when I'm my first shift I wake up at 5 a.m and when I'm my second I wake up at half past seven 
I mean, I could wake up at 5 a.m. as well, but I'd be so tired because I still have a long day to go. And when you finish like 9 p.m., you kind of don't go to sleep immediately. And yeah, it would be quite, quite cruel to wake up at 5 a.m. on my second shift. So that's basically the difference that kind of bugs me and my body because I can feel how tired I am. I'm first shift this um, week. So yeah, I can feel how tired my body is, even though I was, uh, I had my day off yesterday. So yeah, my body is just like, it's a lot going on. So, but I'll get used to it slowly. I mean, you never kind of really, really get used to um, different shifts, but you know, you get a little bit used to it. So that's something. But I've also been very um, good with workouts and I had my checkup with the orthopedist on Monday it's going very well he was very impressed with the muscles I gain and obviously I told him like I'm being really good I'm doing every workout I'm also going to work with bike coming home with bike and it, there's such a difference because I can see the muscles growing even more because of that and I gotta say though uh, when I finish work and when I go on the bike on my way home, I literally die. It hurts so much because obviously I've been on my feet the whole day, I mean the whole eight hours, and then I'm riding that bike as hard as I can, as fast as I can, and yeah, my legs are literally like at the, at the verge of giving up. And yeah, when I come home, I'm like, oh my god, then I have to do workout as well. But it's just something that I want because my body feels great after that. And I've been focusing on back workouts as well because my orthopedist said that, you know, if my right leg, the one that's healthy, hurts, because I talked about that because I think there was something wrong with the nerve. It was kind of squished maybe. It's still a little bit is, but it's getting so much better. And also he recommended to do the back exercises, which I already started doing. And I can see the difference so much. It helps so much. Literally, my leg doesn't hurt as much because I'm kind of making the muscles around my back even more stronger. So kind of holds everything in the place as it should. So that's very good. And yeah, I love it. So yeah, that's been new. This is my third week working already. So I kind of got used to it actually um i'm still taking it easy i'm not exaggerating and just going full on but um i do have some limitations as well my doctor wrote them and i gave them to my bosses as well so yeah i'm just starting slowly and you know day by day it's gonna get better also Kali's there she just ate she's a little uh she still has her cone by the way uh because I mean, her paws are getting so much be better than they were. <laughs> but um, uh, she's not supposed to lick them. And we tried one day, you know, without the cone. And we caught her and she was like licking the paws a lot. And if she's licking it, she's making it worse because it's not helping. So, yeah, that's why she still has cone on. She probably will have it maybe for a month, let's say, until we're definitely sure that everything's okay, but her paws are looking very nicely and the hairs are growing back, so it's all good. So yeah, I'm just glad that it, it was nothing serious, of course. Um, but I'll also uh, go eat something and I also got my um, period today. So I'm feeling a little bit tired, even more tired actually, and just a little low on energy. So I'm gonna go eat some we made cinnamon rolls yesterday, so I'm gonna eat that. And uh, I still have some pancakes left from the morning, so I'll probably eat that as well. And then I'll go watch my manifest, because I'm quite literally obsessed with it. I'm obsessed with every show I start watching that I actually like, so... Yeah, that's gonna be my little evening. <gasps> she licked her paws. Kali! <laughs> yeah she licked her paws i'm gonna have to put the cone on her so i'll go do that now and i'll catch you probably tomorrow i swear of all the oh and now she just left but of all the places she could sit she sits i mean lays down right here on my backpack even though i made that 
very comfortable for her. I got her even the pillow, you know, to sleep. And no, she just chooses my backpack over here. She is a funny lady. <laughs> um, but yeah, hi everyone. I actually haven't seen you for a week since I last talked to you. And then I thought I'd be posting like a video on previous Sunday, but I didn't because I didn't have enough material to just post the video. So I decided, okay, I'm just gonna leave that week as well. And then I'll post it, you know, this Sunday. Sorry, I, I'm just kind of getting used to being back at work. And then it's kind of a little harder than I thought. Um, uh, meaning with all of the things at home. And I get really frustrated when I'm working my second shift and then when I get home, I kind of get really frustrated because it's not as clean as I would want it to. I mean, Anil also helps a lot, of course, but he has his own things to do as well. And then it's very different because, you know, when I used to be at home, you know, on my sick leave, Kali, when I used to be here at home, I just, you know, I had so much time and I could literally clean every day and everything would be like clean, it would be nice, fresh, and it would be good. But now I just, I don't have as much time, then obviously I can't clean every day. And especially when I'm working my second shift, because usually in the morning I do my workout. Well, first of all, I drink my tea, do my makeup, of course. Uh, then I do my workout uh make myself some breakfast then i first take maggie out because uh, vanessa and dennis are still working very very long hours and then we're taking maggie out as much as we can so i take her out maggie then i come back and i take kali out i can't take them together i have to take them separately because i have to exhaust kali like all the way possible so she can be quiet and calm when i go to work because she's alone as I said, we had a lot of troubles with her being alone. She used to bark a lot. Now it's way, way better, but we do have to exhaust her for like a straight, at least a half an hour, if not even more. So I have to take them separately, take Maggie out so she can pee, maybe poop if she has to. So we're out for like 10 minutes, nothing special. Then I um, take her back and then I immediately take Kali out and then we're out for quite a long time because I really have to exhaust her. And then I come here, change and leave her, give her the food and I literally just go. So yeah, I, I even, I was like, that's why I had kind of troubles filming because I was like, when, how? But now I'm just finding the time. I'm doing my makeup and I'm still vlogging. So that's something. <laughs> so I'm trying to do as many things as possible, you know, at the same time as much as I can, but I do have to be careful of the time. Uh, it's five minutes till 9 a.m. So, yeah, I won't be talking for a very long time. Um, but also, it's been really chilly now. Really, really chilly. And I think slowly it's time to get my parka out because it's just... As I said, I go to work with my bike. And obviously, when you're on the bike, it, it's a little bit colder because, you know, the wind is coming at you. So... I kind of came prepared. I do have to wash my parka first and then I'll be able to do anything. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just kind of getting used to that. And then Halloween's over and now we're getting into the Christmas spirit. And it's actually 16th of November. So is it too early to put up my Christmas decorations? I'm kind of in dilemma here. Some say it, it is, some say it's not. I saw some of the neighbors have their Christmas decoration on already. So thinking I might do that this weekend because I'm free. Me and Anna are both free for the weekend. And then next weekend we have three days off because we took one day off. So uh, we have a longer weekend, which is amazing. Um, so I'm thinking, should I do it this week or should I do it next week? Because next week is like maybe better. This week is maybe a little too early. But I think last years, I, I had Christmas decorations up by that time. So I think, mm, as I know myself, I don't know, maybe I'll put it on. Oh my gosh, yeah, I know myself. I, pr I probably will, probably will, yeah, because I have time and then... Uh, I'll see, okay, but uh, I'm leaning towards the Christmas decorations like 70% yes, 30% not. So 
you s I guess there's actually no dilemma because yes wins so I'll probably do that but I'll also love you and leave you for this short little vlog um, I still have a lot of things to do now and will do my workout now and yeah I hope you enjoyed this video sorry I wasn't um, around for like three weeks but I kind of have to get um, back to being used to everything and then making time as I can kind of organizing the time so I think now I kind of kind of I'm not still there yet but I kind of made it <laughs> so um yeah from now on I'll be posting um regularly as I did before so yeah thank you so much for watching I really appreciate it and I'll hopefully see you in my next video which might be putting up the Christmas decorations yeah I think it will be so yeah thanks so much again and I'll see you there so stay safe until then you guys Bye.